questions whatever um just talk a little bit about day two obviously you guys were kind of getting back in the swing of things how have you adjusted some to the new staff a little bit of differences mostly nuances probably but um the adjustment has been like it's been it's been good like it's a lot of enforcers man like more discipline like better focus on the details and stuff mm -hmm. like that and um just like understanding the scheme and things and just understanding like what they expect every day Coach Giles, obviously new position coach for you. Are you working with Coach Giles, right? He's yeah. doing the edges too. Mm -hmm. uh, what's it been like kind of getting to know him a little bit? He's been around the coaching business for a while. You may have heard of him before. Uh, he old but. school, like he only got one motto, just go. Funny, but like he, he like he demands a lot out of you just for the most part. But uh, just understanding how to play football, understanding your technique, your responsibility, and just becoming like a better version of yourself every day. Uh, kind of growing over the last couple of years, you've had some guys ahead of you that you've kind of learned behind yeah. that are, you know, pursuing their pro careers now. What's it like getting to kind of watch how those guys go thing, go through things, maybe even learn from them a little bit about the way things should be done to be successful and get to that next level? Uh, I learned from like uh, DP, uh, learned a lot like as far as like just having a mindset and being the same person every day. Mm -hmm. uh, C's is learning how to like, learning how to like just be just like take care of thing day by day and just being calm what you do and uh david Nguebu, yeah uh, just learning how to be a pro learning how like like every little thing matters no matter if it's good or bad like you gotta like you gotta do it so that's what i took the most part from it. anything you trying to work on as a group and then also as just for yourself this this spring things maybe you're trying to get better at heading into the next season uh as far as a group just like coming together because like uh like some guys are still here though for last year but it's a whole lot of like it's a whole different uh, group. So yeah. it's just like uh, coming together, learning from each other. But me personally, just learning, just uh, like basically, basically my technique, just really my technique most of all. And where do you feel like you're at now? Obviously, you've been here a few years now, and, and your body's changed. You know, the, your reps have obviously gone up as you've gone along. Where do you feel like you're at in terms of where you know what I mean? It's been a few years now. You feel like you've I've, seen I've, a lot of growth? Yeah, I've seen a lot of growth, but it's still like still more to improve on. Mm -hmm. I'm still like I'm still, I still I reflect on what all I've done and just like try to like amplify it a little bit more, but also there's just still more stuff to improve. But all in all, like I've been been pretty good. Yep. What have these first couple of practices been like in terms of just adjusting to you know, the new coaching staff and like that? Uh, first of all, the speed, like really the speed of practice, because like last year it was more like you know what I'm saying it by it, but like it's when you like as soon as you step on the grass and first whistle, like it's it's like full go, full go, full go. It's like more like I'm more fatigued in practice than I was last year. Like I feel myself uh, conditioning, learning how to think when I'm tired, learning how to go through adversity, and um, just learning how to just just how to do things uh, the right way and just learning how to be a pro with certain things. But all in all, like these first two days have been good. Like I'm ready to see what we're gonna be like in the spring. And it seems like this coaching staff is really emphasizing you know, doing little things, you know, mm -hmm. ball security, you know, with offense things like that, or sure keeping your helmet off, hydrating things like that. Yeah, uh, for the most part, yeah, all that. And it's like, I've never been a part of a coach staff that really amplifies every little thing. Like, they really don't focus on nothing big. They focus on everything that's small because if you, focus, if you do a small, everything like that's big will come about. So I'm really trying to emphasize that and on the field, but mostly off the field. So a lot of stuff I'm learning, like from this coach staff, I try to implement it in my everyday life. But it, it takes time. Like, not everything will happen in one day. So you just got to have that mindset and just, just keep taking it day by day, but also putting your best before forward every day. Uh, how would you assess the overall vibe at, you know, at spring camp compared to, you know, previous ones and just the overall experience this year compared to before? Uh, I say, like, like I said, like, like just more, I'm more fatigued. And it's like, it's like everything's fast paced, it's constantly, constantly, there's no stop. But also they emphasize on like getting water and don't just, don't just take water here and there, do it the whole practice. So it emphasizes like keeping yourself healthy. And they also like say like, if you know you're hurting, like let somebody know, don't just push past the injury where you like, where you mess yourself up. But all in all, like this, this is gonna be a good spring. Like everybody's out here competing. Everybody has their best in interest. Everybody just wanna get better because like, like last year it was a big disappointment, you know. But like now it's like, okay, we, we got a feeling like we go, we about to be something special this year. So it just like taking it day by day. I feel like the buy-in's been pretty good since a lot of those things you're talking about like make sense when you you know when you think about the attention to detail and the staff and finishing every single play and all that. I feel like the buy-in's been pretty quick on that. Oh yeah, like seems like like the first week, 
like the first first two weeks, like when they got here, like everybody started buying in because everybody started seeing their results. And everybody just wanted like everybody just want a better version of each person, also their sales. So it's just like it's either you on board or you not, because at the end of the day, they're gonna keep rolling with them without you. Fair. Good.